Hi everyone and welcome to Ancestors Legacy. So, Ancestors Legacy is a squad-based real-time strategy game inspired by medieval European history and is developed by Destructive Creations, which you might have heard of due to some controversy surrounding their previous game Hatred. However, this is a completely different game and doesn't really have much to do with their previous one. So, let's check it out, shall we? I haven't really played it yet, so this is going to be more or less a let's try. Let's see what we got here. We got five chapters. We can pick who we want to play as, or maybe not so much. These are all locked, from the looks of it. So, we will be playing as the Vikings. Fine by me! We can change difficulty. Easy, normal, hard. Let's keep it on easy. Alright, let's get started. On June 5th, 793, a storm was approaching the shores of the Kingdom of Northumbria. A few months earlier, Althing, the Council of Vikings, made the decision to plunder its largest abbey, the famous Lindisfarne. One of the leaders of this expedition was Jarl Ulf Ironbeard, a stern but respected man among his people. However, it wasn't meant for all of the Northmen to reach Lindisfarne by the sea. A storm that hit the coast of Northumbria has scattered some of their ships miles away from their destination. Ulf's raiding party landed near a town called Bambara. The Northmen saw it as an easy target to plunder. Little did they know that all of Northumbria was just coming out of a bloody civil war. Troops of a new King Ethel were battling remnants of recently murdered King Osred's royal army. For this reason, heavy garrisons were scattered throughout the country, and one of them was stationed just outside Bambara. Okay then. Off the course. That's going to be the first mission. I can't see a whole lot. They're not having a good time though. That's a pretty long introduction, I have to say. <laughs> Ancestors Legacy, yeah, we already knew that part. Okay, squad selection. Hover your mouse over a squad and left click to select it. So standard stuff right there. Right click on the map. 
We can also rotate to set which way they are going to be facing after the move. Is there a pause or something like that? I don't know, maybe. Meet with Ulf. Well, right here. Here you are. Quick. What up, bro? Banner list. Notice the squad selection banners on the HUD. They show all your available squads and their statuses. Left clicking the top banner selects that squad. Double clicking jumps to the squad. Okay, then. So, right here. Double click to jump. So, up to 10 squads from the looks of it. Alright. Let's keep moving then. Join your Looks allies. Like storm has set us all and all of us to survive. Sure? As you might expect. Yes, we'll never break through with those archers shooting at us! Let's try to encircle them. There should be another way along the shore. Okay. Flank the defenders. So, hold on. All the way over here. Alright then. That's where we're going. And we got more dudes over there. Squad attack, right click on enemy to attack, yep, as you might expect. I wouldn't have guessed. <laughs> we need help. Can we move after engaging? Nope. Okay then. So let's see, we got some info down here. Longbowman. Okay, high mobility. Didn't have enough time to read that. Selecting way. squads. To select multiple squads, yep, yeah, I yeah, guess. We can also select all of them with Ctrl A. So that's a thing. Let's keep moving. Uh, can we rotate the camera? I don't think so. At least I don't see an obvious way to rotate the camera. Alright, let's keep moving then. Flank and charge. Charging an enemy or attacking them from the rear or flanks causes extra damage and lowers enemy morale, even before the actual fight begins. This can give you a significant advantage. Okay, then. Them! Damn right. I think they are just a little bit screwed. I assume this is all basically a tutorial. Bye bye. How far can we zoom in? About this far. Okay, we can actually zoom in super far. Like all the way down here. Which makes the interface disappear. Alright, let's kill them all. Bye bye. Maybe one thing at a time, all of these buildings to prevent reinforcements. Gods are with us. It stopped raining. Now we can burn everything down. Sounds good. Let's burn everything down then. All has to survive, destroy key buildings. Okay. I suppose he could split up, but... Well, yeah, sure. Let's make two squads. Group one, group two. Alright. Let's keep moving. These guys are engaged. Uh, hold on. Group one. Group two. Yep. 
wasn't also what it was supposed to be. Yeah, I can't move these because they are already engaged. Here, they have to finish the fight before we can disengage from the looks of it. Unless there's an option to do that. Record squad, selection menu... Alright, let's burn these down. Destroying buildings. The green bar over the building indicates its health. A red bar shows its progress in being burned down. Keep throwing torches to fill the bar more quickly. Alright. Well, that will do, I guess. It's going down. Yep, that's that. We are almost done. Oh yeah, we got the main building here. And it's defended. As you might expect. Let me finish this one. It's not quite done yet. That will do. So what kinds of units are these? Shield bearer, spear raiders, shield bearer and obviously Olf. Let's maybe not send him first, that sounds like a pretty bad idea. Alright, go. We can zoom in to see the fight. Try harder! They are going down. And it looks like that's done. Burn it down. Are we there yet? They don't have a chance. No time to waste. Well, that's that. I think we got rid of everything. Yep. Brace yourselves! They're coming in great numbers. Defend yourself. Stances. Press change stance toggle in the squad menu to change formation. Okay, done here. Switch between offensive and defensive stance. Okay, can we see the effects? We can see the icon, defensive stance. But I'm not seeing actual effects. Other than, you know, increased defense. Get them, boys. What, giving up already? Retreating. Click retreat in the squad menu to fall back to safety. Alright, so done here. Chapter complete. Wasn't much of a chapter, was it? Overwhelmed by the forces of the enemy, cut off from their ships, the Northmen had to escape. Those who did not retreat in time lost their lives or became captives. Once harsh invaders looking for prey, the Northmen suddenly became prey themselves. Luckily, they found salvation in a nearby forest, which became their temporary shelter. Here, they could catch a moment of respite from the pursuing Britons. Here, Jarl Ulf Ironbeard, who suffered injuries during the fight, 
could heal his wounds and recover. However, a new problem arose for the people of the North. In order to survive and to have any chance to join the rest of the expedition against Lindisfarne, they had to gather food and supplies. Rebuilding forces. Okay. You made it! Good to see you alive, Jarl. We retreated as soon as they started winning the battle in the village. We lost many good men in there, and many were taken hostage. Tonight, they dine in Valhalla. Look! It's our scout! He's back! I found food supplies. There is a farm and a hunting hut north from here. If we plunder both places, we will have food for many days. We cannot go. We need to patch our wounds. Take care of your warriors, brother. I'll get those supplies. All right, then. Quiet. There's a lot of enemies nearby. I'll be scouting the nearby. That's our squad right here. Spear Raiders. Let's go there. Replenish your squad. Use retreat. Or go back to a camp you control. What do we have here? Chase. Momentarily increases speed but reduces defense. Defensive circle. The squad forms a defensive circle with their spears, increasing their defense but immobilizing them. Okay, like this. Change stance. So switch between offensive and defensive. Can we see some detailed information about offensive and defensive stance anywhere? I don't think so. And the retreat. Okay. I assume chase will be useful <laughs> somewhere around here. You know, just a wild guess. Totally no reason. Stop. Someone's coming. We can't let him alarm anyone. Oh look! <laughs> Let's make Speaking of chase, one of those bushes. We okay. Don't get too close to the light, or they will notice us. Fair enough. We're going there fast. We'll wait around here. Bushes. High grass and bushes are good hiding places. As long as your squad stays inside them, enemies can't see you. This can give you a significant tactical advantage. Alright then. I guess we'll just chill over here for a moment. And wait until he comes close. Yes, get over here. And let's activate chase. Probably not needed, but whatever. Here. I think he's dead. Now we can plunder. Let's go there. Leave nothing but ashes. All right. Time to look for the hunting hut. We're going there fast. Let's move on. I assume there will be more dudes around here. Yep. Wait. A whole group. That's a strong squad. They probably got a camp nearby. Let's hide in the bushes and wait for them to pass. Prepare an ambush out there. Well, that will do. Totally nothing to see here. <laughs> Look, an abandoned camp. Yes, no, totally abandoned. To that wasn't theirs at all. Okay. Let's hide over here. It seems like they are taking our allies somewhere. Interesting. Should we kill these guys over here? I think so. Let's hide over there. I don't see why not. We're going there fast. 
Well, yeah, too late. All right, let's just kill them. Whatever. Shouldn't be a problem. I don't think so. There are three of us and only two of them. Can we see any combat information or something? Spear guards. I can zoom in and that's about it. Come on, kill them faster. We need to move on. We did lose one guy. Come on, kill him. Try harder. There, he's dead. Some of the animations are quite nice. Okay, now we're down to two, which is probably not brilliant. We should rest and heal. Yes, we should. Okay, another group. Let's maybe not fight them. No, that's not a group, that's just one guy. Might want to kill him or something. Don't move in just yet. Just need to sneak up on him. Let's go there. Quick, we're moving up fire! Alright, get him, boys. Oh, there are more incoming. That's probably not good. Yep, let's retreat. We can't beat them. Move quickly. So, how do we rest? Right here, healing camp. We can do that. How long will that take? Did we get our third guy back? <laughs> no, I don't think so. We just healed the two existing ones. Would be a little bit weird if you resurrected the third guy. Just by resting. So, what do we do about this fella? Now he's coming. Let's see if we can kill him fast enough. Before the other group joins us. I think we can. There, he's dead. Okay. Can we just use this indefinitely? I think we can. We should rest before we go any further. Get ready. Okay, that will do. Can we just sneak past them? There they are. I think they will see us. Uh, maybe not. No, they will not. But here's another one. Two guys over here. Let's try to avoid fighting all of them. I think they will see us. No, there are way too many around here. Yep, they saw us. No, I don't think we can beat them. Nope. We can try taking the long way. That might be a better idea. Also, is there anything down here? We haven't checked. Might be worth taking a look. Let's heal up first. I don't think there's anything down here. Nope, not really. Off we go then. We'll just have to go around them. I don't think we're supposed to fight them all. <laughs> Probably not. Well, we are likely supposed to have one more guy. But I can't bring him back other than by restarting. Just follow the road. Nobody will suspect us. We can hide in plain sight. 
There are some bushes around here. Yeah, let's not fight the guards. That's a poor idea. But we got some bushes. Going there, fast. Let's hide over there. Here's okay. their camp. All the nearby units come from here. Yeah, what about that? Let's hide over there. Yeah, this is definitely not safe. Not in any way. Let's see if we can sneak Let's through here. Yep. So far, so good. We are almost there. I'm a double. Here, I think we're in the clear. Let's go there. Clear the enemy camp, really? So you're expecting us to clear Let's the enemy the camp? Guards. Apparently so. Interesting. Well, this is just a civilian mob. We can probably handle that. And there are two guys asleep over here. I'm a devil. How about we kill them first or something? Yeah, let's try that. Kill them in their sleep. There, one down. I assume we'll beat them quite easily, but I don't know. Let's find out. We might or might not. Again, these are just civilians. Yeah, they are dead. No problem. Now would be a good moment to heal. That's Yoder. Poor bastard. His squad must have wandered off when we retreated from the beach. It seems like they wanted some food and got killed by the Brits. Fools. Wait. There's a blood trail. Maybe someone survived. We need to find out. Look for survivors. Okay, then. Let's take to the bushes. And don't be heal up before we move. On your feet. That will do. I can't go any further. So wait, where are they supposed to be exactly? Healing warriors. All squads capable of healing can use the healing camp skill whenever their health is depleted. This can only be done outside of combat and squads involved in the healing camp are particularly vulnerable to enemy attacks. Another way to heal is to travel or retreat directly to your base, at which they heal automatically. Okay, then, well, we already knew that. Here's some blood. We're going there fast. A corpse. One of us must have fallen to those filthy Brits. It's Sven. It was his first raid. Bastard. Yeah, he's not having a good he must time. Must have escaped the Christians. But they got him eventually. How's it hanging, bro? <laughs> Maybe they went the other way. Let's go. So this way. Find all their lead. We were literally just right there. Right. Maybe the other direction. Let's go. An axe. It looks like Gotland's craft. It belonged to one of us. We must be getting close. Let's go. Are we there yet? I think this is probably it. The Brits. They must have taken our brothers. We have to get them out. There's too many of them. We should eliminate one squad at a time. Yeah, sure. With two of us? That seems like a bit of a stretch, maybe. In this village, someone will come to check what's going on. If you say so. I got some doubts whether we stand a chance, but apparently we do. So, this way. Wasn't this guarded? Yeah, it was guarded. 
That's just a civilian. We don't even have to attack them. Or him. There's just one. Well, I suppose we might as well kill him. Yeah, whatever. Let's just kill him. It's fine. It's not like he's very strong. Here, he's already dead. No problem. This won't work. We need to find something more flammable. Use cart to burn the house. There, you happy now? I assume they will come to check it out now. <laughs> that guy over there. Let's go. Let's hide in the bushes. So. Out there. Oh, burn down more houses, right? Because apparently one was not Let's enough. Go. They don't care about one house burning down. It's just not worth moving for that. Who cares about one single house, right? Just let it burn. They're too lazy for that shit. Burn it down. We're going there fast. Well, that should do it. This here do it. That's what I just said. <laughs> I assume the allies will join us, and then we can beat them. Let's hide over here. Okay, yep, they are running away. These are some proper spear guards over here, not civilians. So I don't know about this. Well, they are not at full health, so I guess we'll kill them. Yep, they are going down. Here, we got some more. Great job. Two more to go. This Let's go. Looks like a good place to rest. Spears, Can we rest? It's ready, archers. No. What are these? Hold fire, stay and fight. All right then. We are mostly at full health, actually. That's why we can't rest. <laughs> There's no need to rest. Let's just charge them. Go, go, go. They are about to have a bad time. Just a little bit. Oh, friendly fire! So this game actually has friendly fire. Okay. I actually like that. Another camp. Another village. We can burn it down to draw their attention and free our brothers. We can, but we don't have to. <laughs> but yeah, we probably should. Let's just go. Just some peasants guarding it. Literally one guy guarding it. Sorry bro, this is just not your day. So that will do. One more? Or is that enough? I don't see another card. Is there another move, card? Move. Well, there's a house we can burn down. Burn it down. Oh no, there is another card on the left, right. Come on, guys. Burn. Let's go. Burn it down. Burn it down. And there's one more guard. Not much of a guard, really. He's not doing a very good job. His entire village is burning and he's just standing there and chilling. I don't think he noticed. Now he's moving. He noticed something is going on. That guy is still following us. Where do you think you're going? I would probably run the heck away if I was him. 
instead of chasing two squads of dudes. But what do I know? So, are they going to move or what? Maybe we should just ambush them. Maybe we didn't burn down that village enough. You know what, screw it, let's just kill them. Just go, it's fine. You know what, we should probably attack from the side with our ranged guys. Because friendly fire is a thing. Here, that should do it. From the flank. Yep. Where do you think you're going? I don't think so, buddy. Now would be a good moment to heal up. Yep, we lost one warrior in that group. They are not very good at melee, as you might have guessed. Here, we got another squad. Now we can heal up, though. So let's do that real quick. Spear Raiders. So now we have Norse Archers and two groups of Spear Raiders. One more village. Or rather, one more camp. Let's go then. Yes, all of you. Let's go. I assume there's going to be another village we can burn down. But perhaps that won't even be necessary. Yeah, don't charge straight into these guys. Especially not with ranged. We can charge him with our melee though. Just kill them all, because why the heck not? Might as well. Oh, these are a little bit tougher actually. Yes, they are. Spear guards. Right. We need a little bit of help. Yeah, these are way tougher, actually. Let's heal up. In the middle of the road, we're just chilling, having a picnic. What does that green star mean? Extra experience? Specialization. Oh, hold on. What is this all about? Defensive, offensive, and speed. Significant increase to defense and slight increase to missile defense. Significant increase to attack value. Increased movement and healing speed. Increased rate of fire. Reduced cooldowns of skills and toggles. Slight attack and defense increase. Slight boost to cavalry charge. Let's go for offensive. You know what they say, offense is the best defense. We need to go this way. Downhill. <laughs> These are spear guards. Yep, let's maybe not fight them if we don't have to. These guys were quite tough. This way. So where's that camp? Oh, up here. Moving out. Is that up or down? We need to go around, apparently. Moving out. If you say so. Don't shoot! I'm a Northman like you. I managed to escape. Where are the others? In the other camp. You'll need men to set them free, and you need to hurry up. The Brits want to set them on fire as an act of revenge. Okay. Yeah, they are not having a good time. We 
We better hurry up then. All right, let's go. So who's this guy? Shieldbearer. Just one. So do we just charge straight into them? Yeah, I guess we do. Because why not? And shoot them. Before they run away. I think they will run away actually. Maybe not. They got nowhere to run anymore. Here. He's dead. And we can set everything on fire because why not? We're Vikings after all. So... I'll just charge straight into them. There are some spear guards over there. So let's maybe target the spear guards with our ranged. Maybe slightly from the flank so that we won't hit our own guys. That should do. Yes, I can see that guy on the left. Kill him. Our brave soldiers will join you in your mission. There. Done. All hail the god who reigns. Recruited. Supreme. Godric. Good to have you all back. One who of the rebels fighting against the new English you. king. The name's Godric. Take me with you and I'll help you. What does he have I'll here? Too late. Where you can get wood. We could go there and secure those resources. Not done yet. Clear the enemy camp. Up to six squads now. And now we are supposed to protect Godric. Alright then. Maybe we should, you know, set up in a proper formation. That might be a good idea. I wonder if you can preserve a formation. Maybe. This looks a little bit quiet. Good to see you. I saw a party of Brits heading in that direction. They want our wood. We need it to repair ships and build siege machines. We need to secure this wood camp at all costs. Collect wood. Yeah, all right. Let's go there. Spears, listen. Moving out. Sure, I'm ready. Just split them up. Let's go. Quickly, there. Is that should be archers? enough. What now? Prepare an ambush. To set a trap where your squad is standing, click trap from the command menu. Okay then. Ready to fight. Get over here. Spike pit trap. No Sounds fun. Ready to fight. Not so much Coming for the on. guys falling into it. There it is. They will be here any minute. Take position. Yeah, let's maybe they set up coming. into a proper formation this time. So ranged in the back. They are already coming. I didn't get a lot of time to set up. More incoming. So what do we have here? Intense fire for a short period of time. Archers have increased shooting speed. Okay, we can use that. What else do we have? Chase, defensive circle. Okay. Raise shields, change stance. We can change into defensive because these guys are not doing so great. These are not doing so great. Are we actually going to win here? <laughs> I don't know about that. Yeah, they need to heal up. But now they are all the way in the back. That does give us a chance to heal up. Who's this guy? Slingers, right. I think we win. Thanks to our archers, largely. Are we done? Let's get there fast. We made it. All the Christians are dead. Yep, we are done. Chapter complete. Okay then.
So I think that's a good moment to make a cut. I'm not sure how much I'm going to do, this is supposed to be a less try, but we'll see. For now, that's it, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, leave a like if you did, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.